Well, that's the lunchtime news. Our next news is at 5.40. Now let's have a look at that freezing weather with Jack Scott. Well, we now know that it's Rennie Powell that we've got to blame for this wintry weather. And the wintry weather, of course, is going to continue. Believe it or not, what's controlling the weather at the moment is this high pressure up here over Greenland and another belt of high pressure that's away over Eastern Europe and Russia as well. Morning, Albert. Shite weather for the time of year, isn't it? Fuck off, you flid. Who do you think you are? Jack Scott? Looks all right to me. Ah, well, I suppose it nicely compliments your persona. You what? Well, when you were in the trenches or at Waterloo, I should imagine it were pretty grim, weather-wise anyway, probably pissing it down and full of mud. And you've been conditioned. What the fuck you on about? Well, this place. It's perfect. For a miserable old git like you, this weather's like a mirror on your soul. Aye, but I was conditioned long before I went to Waterloo. This used to be a burial pit for Black Death. <laughs> I bet you miss it, don't you? Aye, I do bloody miss it. Aye, there were a real sense of community when you used to have to bring out your dead, am I right, Albert? Aye. Not same, is it? Aye, well you don't know you're bloody born till you've that bubonic plague. I know, I'll always regret that I missed out on it. Aye, well them were real good old days. Aye, I know, my grandad used to tell me I missed out on rickets, scarlet fever and consumption. I didn't even catch friggin' polio when I was a kid. Is any wonder I feel deprived and I have to make do with miniskirts and anal sex? Serves you right. If only I'd played my cards right, I could have been in an iron lung. You're right, Albert. I don't know, I'm bloody born. That's it. See you later.